They say genius strikes like lightning, but sometimes it just falls from a tree. Let's ask the man who made gravity fall into place. Welcome to Ipse Dixit, science spoken. It was the year 1666. Cambridge was closed. The plague had sent us all away. I returned to my home in Woolsthorpe, where the world seemed still. One afternoon, beneath this apple tree, I watched a fruit fall. I asked myself, why does it always fall toward the Earth's center? Why not sideways or upward? What unseen power draws it down? I began to wonder if that same pool might reach far beyond the trees, perhaps even to the moon. If the Earth attracts the apple, might it not also hold the moon in her path? The farther the distance, the weaker the pull by the square of that distance. From that thought grew a universal law, one that binds all matter from falling fruit to the dance of the planets. So it wasn't a bump on the head, it was a spark in the mind. Thanks, Sir Isaac. Lesson learned, space pirates. <laughs>